HPL is still investigating what happened, but they do say that fog might have been a factor in that deadly crash. A uh, closer look here at where this happened. Investigators say that about 440 this morning, a Toyota Avalon driving eastbound on 80 crashed into the center divide right near Richards Boulevard. Uh, well, then that car was hit by two other vehicles. Fox 40's Jeannie Nguyen joining us live along I-80 with what we know so far about that crash. Jeannie. Eric and Nikki, this is around the area that the crash happened. And while it's been cleared now, the drivers we spoke with say they had a bad feeling after seeing the scene. This may look like just another day on I-80 East near Richards Boulevard in Davis. But this morning, it was a chaotic scene. Looks like there was a lot of police and firefighter on the scene. Sacramento resident Mark Borbe was on his way to work in Fairfield this morning, driving west on I-80. There was a vehicle, looks like it caught on fire, and um, it was all black. The CHP tell us this crash happened just after 4.30 this morning when a Toyota Avalon, going east on I-80, crashed into the center divide. At that point, a box truck and a Toyota Tacoma hit the Avalon. Police say a one-year-old girl inside the Avalon was ejected and died on the scene. Both the driver and passenger were badly hurt, but survived and were sent to the hospital. It's just really sad. I'm praying for the family and condolences. That crash happened around this area, and while traffic is free-flowing right now, drivers like Borbe tell me he's not surprised about the crash after seeing just how bad the fog was this morning. It was very foggy. I could barely see the vehicle in front of me. I just only could see the, the taillights. I could barely see the the lights in the in the freeway as well. I'm just following the lights in front of me. Reminding everyone to be careful and drive slower in foggy weather. Now the drivers in the box truck and the Tacoma were not badly hurt, but the CHP says they're still investigating the cause and believe the fog played a big role. Live in Davis, Jeannie Nguyen, Fox 40 News.